Hello makers, welcome to the Frontier Shed. If you're like me and you get involved in metal projects, you're no doubt quite familiar with the angle grinder with the zip disc. I've been using this for a long time for cutting metal stock for my projects. But I find it near impossible to get true 90 degree cuts or, or 45 degree cuts. And uh, so I've come up with something new. Let me show you my creation. So here's my latest creation from the Frontier Shed. I took my angle grinder and uh, mounted it with a custom bracket onto a sliding mechanism and uh, enables me to use the angle grinder like a miter saw. Nice smooth operation. Uh, gives me exactly a 90 degree cut and I can pivot the uh, fence over to the second hole here. Gives me a true 45 degree cut. The uh, sliding mechanism is rather unique. It's comprised of a couple of one and a half inch conduits with one inch holes cut in them. This is a chrome shower curtain bar that uh, I had laying around. And uh, put a tailpiece on here. There's a slot uh, at this end that allows me to skew these rods uh, to ensure that I can align the uh, cutting wheel so it's cutting true. With the angle grinder tipped up into the cutting position, it's necessary to be able to tilt the blade relative to the table to keep it perpendicular. This ski boot buckle with a length of nylon strapping allows me to offset the handle of the grinder relative to the bracket to accomplish this. Took a chunk of oak flooring, drilled a hole in it, and uh, used a hot glue gun to glue it onto a chunk of rebar that was welded on the side of this plate. Gives me a nice, firm, comfortable grip handle. So there you have it makers, hopefully this inspires you to tune up your angle grinder and, and make a miter saw with it. Thanks for checking in.